as we do start to warm up, it is going to be a bit oppressive for that bike riding forecast. So just be mindful. Uh, I'm not going to say it's not going to be a good day for it. But if you are looking to break a sweat, you don't have to ride the bike to do that. You can just stand outside and it won't take long for you to break a sweat just because of how hot and humid it is going to be. Thankfully, slightly better an improvement from yesterday highs are going to be right around 91 yesterday our high temperature in evansville was 93 and we did have heat index values in the upper 90s in the triple digits today i don't think we're going to reach the triple digits we do have that patio forecast you can see through the day this is what you're going to expect upper 70s through the morning then by the afternoon once again we'll be in those upper 80s and lower 90s if you're wanting to head out to the drive-in we will see primarily dry skies. A few of those isolated showers can't be ruled out, but expect it to be another warm and muggy evening. And we'll continue to see those temperatures drop down into the mid 70s as we're heading out for your Wednesday morning. And we will see another day back in the 90s. And that's why I, I'm going to tell you over and over this week, we're really not going to see a change in that weather pattern. Even though we are tracking in scattered showers and thunderstorms, they're not going to do enough to bring us a big change in the coming days. They'll bring us that temporary relief. Tomorrow, though, we're not expected to see any real activity in the way of rainfall. We will begin drying out. You can see through the day today, we've got isolated showers that will likely pop up and then perhaps Perhaps a few that could linger into your evening hours, but heading into Wednesday, we're going to begin this drying process that is going to lead us into uh, a couple of days in the lower 90s. Not as high heat index values, but Friday and Saturday, it is looking to be a little dangerously hot. As far as Sunday, we're watching another storm system that will start to cool us down into next week.